I wish I was drunker. It was a D movie. I deflated the balls, Jack. Greg's favorite movies are D movies. That's right. Deflated the balls in like a porno theater. Yeah. Anyways, Rachel Nichols, spot on. Roger Goodell. And he didn't answer how they can take steps later. He never answered her question. No, he didn't. He just defended everything that we already know. Right. He just gave his stupid answer. It mm-hmm. didn't mean anything. Um, what else from the Super Bowl? Uh, Goodell says he's in the NFL, so not passing judgment against the Pats or any of their employees yet. They're still investigating. You have no evidence yeah. other than that the balls were deflated. <laughs> right. Super but you, Bowl. you can't say who did it. So we've crowned a champion. Wait for us to negate it later. Mm-hmm. Right. The and now, didn't they now say that the refs may not have even recorded the actual inflation? I wouldn't be surprised. Of the balls? I didn't get that far, but you know. I think I think it came out this week that they never actually recorded what they they were at before the game. They so probably they, even checked. They could have been underinflated the whole time, and the Patriots did nothing wrong other than bring balls that were underinflated. At that point, it's yeah. the refs' fault. But that's their fault. Yeah. Yeah. Stupid. Uh, Aaron Rodgers wins the MVP this year. Uh, not a total surprise. I say it should either be him or the now uh, defensive player of the year, J.J. Watt. Yeah. Uh, he did get, though, he's all 50 votes, which first player in history to get all 50 really? defensive player of the year votes. Wow. Year. You know, I kind of thought, like, they didn't give him the MVP just because, you know, LT never got one and, you know, um, you know I'm trying to think. Ray Lewis never got one. I think it's because they didn't make the playoffs. Yeah, and that's it's partially. Like how, but, how valuable are you if you can't even get to the playoffs? Yeah, but, I mean, how much can one guy do? I mean, the guy was trying to play offense at the same time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, next know? year when he does play offense. But offense, if you look it. at the stats for the Texans, look at last year when they didn't have Arian Foster the full season, they sucked, even with Watts being amazing. Yeah. Foster's back this year, they do much better. So the, the true, duh, but as da- yeah. Dave Damashek says, the Jenga piece for the Texans is Arian Foster. Yeah, but you what take if him out of the lineup, Jenga. they suck. Yeah, but and so if you have Arian Foster and what if J.J. Watt hurts himself, what happens right. to the Texans? It's true. I'd say you're more screwed. It's true, yeah. but, but you can get away with defense that has one player uh, gone uh, rather than the offense's most important player gone. Only player. Perhaps. He's the offense's only, only player. Only player. Because yeah. we saw what happened when they didn't have them. Two games won. And those were the first two games of the season. They had to come back in both those games. Mm-hmm. They could have easily been 0-16. Easily. You know, you know who one of those teams were that they beat? Who? Our favorite friend, San Diego Johnny's team, the Chargers. Ooh. Oh, yeah. what a shame. That's a shame. And uh, DeMarco Murray, Offensive Player of the Year. And I'm sure the Cowboys will wait, find a way to fuck up that contract. <laughs> uh, yeah, by not signing him yet, they've yeah. already fucked it yep. up. Yeah. Yep. They'll sign Garrett before they sign oh, DeMarco so Murray. So stupid. <laughs> I'll take him. They, I think they already do that. They already, oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. They already did. They already it's re-signed five years. Garrett. He's yeah. ready to go. It's ridiculous. Garrett's locked up. So I got 13 stakes over here. <laughs> 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 and, and if you watch the, uh, I don't know if you saw the Pro Bowl, like when they showed the halftime. I did not watch ref, any of the Pro Bowl. The, they showed the coach's like, speech during halftime. He is so fucking cheesy, and none of the players gave a shit. None of the players that played for him gave a shit. They're like, uh, who's this hokey bastard over here? It was like when Mike D'Antoni was talking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anytime he opens his mouth. He's like, come on, man. <laughs> but, uh, the face but, is what made that important. Yeah. This is a podcast. I know. It's too bad you can't see it. Uh, but John Harbaugh. <laughs> You're on the other lucky s- you can't see it. Then there's John Harbaugh on the other side who obviously commands the respect of every player because those guys were listening to him during half. Yeah. If you can yes. step into public wearing those pants, you command respect. <laughs> uh, well, uh, the brother. We're talking about the brother. John. Oh, brother sorry. John. I'm all fucked up. You're tonight. all fucked up today. Deliverance. <laughs> hey, <laughs> both D movies, both J brothers. And you love the D. The Deliverance. I love, love the D. D. I'm gonna I'm gonna let you guys do it. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, everybody. Uh Junior Seau, Jerome Bettis. They were both heading off the Hall of Fame inductees. Mm. Jerome Bettis should have been in there longer than a yes. long time ago. What about Junior Seau? Seau, he's first ballot, so it makes sense. Yeah. But he should be in there. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. What twelve Pro Bowls? Only two crazy for a defensive player. Tell Pro Bowls two holes in his chest. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Too soon? <laughs> no. Too soon, everybody. Too too soon. Too, I actually two don't holes. know. Many Double holes. on time. Was it buckshot or was it? <laughs> <laughs> he was probably <laughs> twenty <one>. soon. Yeah. <laughs> probably one hole. But uh, yeah, Jerome Bettis was he like sixth on the all time rushing list, like second or third or fourth in the touchdown list, and he. Gets in on this fifth or sixth of the year. That's ridiculous. Yeah. Ridiculous. How do you do that to a guy that's a, a Super Bowl champion and he's one of the best running backs of all time? Just because he was a gigantic dude and different than any running back in history? That's right. Mm-hmm. It's dumb. He's the fucking bus. He is. He was yeah. badass, dude. <laughs> he made the Rams relevant when they sucked really bad. That is not easy to do. <laughs> no. 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 There's a Ram in it. And, he brought <laughs> it. and he brought a championship back to Pittsburgh. That's important. Finally, that's the poop. Mm-hmm. Uh, and speaking of uh, entering things... Johnny Football entering a wow. treatment facility. Wow. 
Yeah, he's finally going to rehab. He's a quitter. He is a quitter. <laughs> a fucking quitter. Uh, he's a bitch. And, uh, Did they, they say for what? Alcoholism? They don't give any details out. They, no. they wouldn't even call it a rehab. They just call it treatment center because he has things he needs to work on. Yeah. <laughs> like being a douche. Yeah, doucheism. <laughs> yeah. Uh, NFL PA. Oh, you know what I didn't do? Mm-hmm. I'm going to talk about the next story. I queue up the song for that one. Yeah. Peyton Manning evaluate and return, but uh, he says he's not going to take a long time. He's not going to pull LeBron. No, nah, it's probably going to be this week. And he's probably coming back. The only reason he hasn't made a decision so far is, is Elway told him to take his time. And <laughs> He's like, all right, I'll take a week off. And I'll come hey. back to you. It's like you're just starting to look like a horse. Like, right. Take it, take yeah. it easy. Hey, Elway, <laughs> I'm coming back. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, Drew Brees actually said to him, Peyton, please come back yeah, next Peyton year. Yeah, Manning, please come back or something like that. No, it was Peyton Manning, <laughs> come back next year. They're at some dinner yeah. thing or something. Uh, anyways, back to the previous story now that I have the music all queued up. So get the switch, whip you, baby, with those buns, whip you, baby, oops, I got your nuts, whip you, baby, wait, what's your name, are you my kid, I'll whip you all the same. So, honey, about that doctor's visit. <laughs> That whole <laughs> "Are you my kid?" thing—that's racist. Yeah, listen, <laughs> listen to this old, they all look the same. Listen to this old school stage. Every time that song comes on, that song is like been ruined now. It's like every time <laughs> you, you, see the wrong you see the wrong lyrics. Now. Whip those buns. <laughs> <laughs> I should put all these on YouTube and see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the NFL PA is taking the NFL and Roger Goodell to court over the fact that Goodell told AP. That not only is he suspended the rest of the season, but he had to enter counseling. Players Association says, we don't want our players to get better. We just want them to serve their time. Yeah. No, they <laughs> said, uh, you have no right to do that. He only has um, per- permission, no. Authority, that's what I was looking for. The authority. The authority. Uh, the authority. To. Get you he can suspend <laughs> and he can uh, fire. And he can fine. Mm-hmm. Fire. But he, he cannot tell he you. He cannot impose, to. yeah, anything beyond that. But didn't he suggest it? Uh, was it or was it an actual commandment? It, he was told. From uh, Godel. Yeah, Godel. <laughs> Godel. <laughs> Adrian, <laughs> go forth and seek counseling. As a commissioner with integrity, <clears throat> I command thee to get help. As a commissioner with integrity, Adam Silver told me I should tell you to get help. <laughs> uh, so there's that. Warren Moon. Oh, hold on. I'm still not playing music. I, sh- I should be playing all these songs. This one's yeah. for Tebow. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. All he do is win, 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 no matter what. what? Got Jesus on his mind. He can never get enough. No. And every Can't time he steps up in the field, everybody rush outs go up. Go up. Go up. And they stay there. Yeah. And they stay there. Warren Moon says that Tim Tebow should stop trying to come back. <laughs> He's oh, right. Oh, oh. <laughs> Unless we want stories. I want Tebow to come back. For the show's sake. I, what did I say before? Kaepernick, running back. Tebow, Tebow quarterback. quarterback. Dang. Can't get worse than Kaepernick on the ball. What are you talking about? Man? I think you know. <laughs> no, I Kaepernick don't. Kaepernick would make a great running back. I, I don't think you know how to properly Tebow. evaluate a quarterback. I don't think you actually watched Tim Tebow play <laughs> yeah. other than that one throw to Demarius Thomas. Yeah. I think otherwise. That's that, all I needed to see. But we need this. For the show's sake, we need it back. Thanks for sharing my point again. Yeah. yeah. Do- <laughs> Dr. Bald. <laughs> uh, he says, uh, you know, because T- Tebow's been staying in shape just in case that phone rings. Mm-hmm. And he says, uh, just don't worry about it, man. You're doing a great job on TV, and uh, let's let's keep it there. I thought he stayed in shape because God's watching. There's a little <laughs> bit of that, too. God does not like flabby former quarterbacks. <laughs> That's right. That's why he doesn't masturbate, either. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's why I do masturbate. Watching, oh. watching Tim. Yeah, God is disgusted. <laughs> <laughs> so much jerking off. Throw some this way, too. Yeah, I hope he doesn't get too close when I'm jerking off. <laughs> yeah. Right in his face. I shoot high, people. Right in God's eye. I shoot high. Right. Uh, the 49ers high. I don't even know how to say this guy's name. Jeep Chrysler. Uh, speaking of speaking of God, they've hired Jeep Christ. Is that how you say it? I don't even know. I have no fucking idea. What is Nobody going on with our our, our coaching staff? This is yeah. a fucking tragedy. G e e p. Jeep. 
Geep. Uh, Geep or so- Jeep? Soft Jeep. Jeep. I would Last name, C H. I'm guessing Jeep. Jeep Christ. Son- C-H-R-Y-S-T. Son of Roadrunner? Yeah. Jeep Beep. Yeah. <laughs> Jeep. Jeep Christ. Jeep Christ. Jeep Christ. The new car from Jeep. The Christ. Yeah. Tebow drives that. Oh, God. God. He's the new offensive coordinator. Denver hires Wade Phillips as their defense. Well, to piggyback on the last story, yeah. is this their way of getting Tim Tebow over to the 49ers now? Yeah. They have Jeep Christ on their team. They now have Christ. Mm-hmm. He is on the side of the 49ers. Christ is on their side. Over here. That's right. Seahawks don't stand a chance now. Yeah. Uh, so Denver hires Wade Phillips as their defensive coordinator. Mike McCarthy, Packers Mike McCarthy, has fired their special teams. Coach Sean Slocum blaming someone other than Sean himself. Wow. Slocum. Well, it was their worst year. <laughs> Thank you, Thank you. <laughs> Mike. Mike just like right by it. <laughs> Sean Slocum. Uh, yeah, he had a horrible year. He's replaced by Sean Fastcomb. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> Quick jizz. But Sean with an S E A N is yeah. S H A W N. Sean Quick jizz. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, they had a horrible year on special teams, and then. The two botched plays in the NFC Championship. That didn't help. Yeah. The kicker threw a touchdown pass. I've got to guess that didn't <laughs> help. And then the tight end, who wasn't supposed to do anything but block, went up for the pass. The the Jordy Nelson was right there. Sure-handed Jordy Nelson right there. Luke Wilson, the actor? <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> Ronald Reagan, the actor? <laughs> Back to the future, anybody? Yeah. Uh, the Falcons have hired Seattle's defensive coordinator, Dan Quinn. Makes me shudder. Oh, officially the best coaching hire of the offseason. They need a defensive presence. Better than the Niners hiring Ron Jeremy? <laughs> a little bit better. <laughs> Slightly better. What about John Fox going to the Bears? That's a good coach. It's good, but we don't know what that's going to do. Because John Fox is an all-around coach. He's not a my, a special at one thing or the other. Hmm, okay. Where Dan Quinn is coming into a team that ha- already has a great offense. You need a defensive presence because that's a terrible defense. And you bring the guy who has orchestrated the best defense in the last three years. Right there. There you go. So That's where it's at. <laughs> and, hey, they did their job. They kept the Patriots' score close enough for the Seahawks to win. So you can't right. blame that defense. Ha-ha, Seagulls. Except for Bennett when he crossed the line and encroached when they had a chance to get the ball back. He's encroaching on their decree. <laughs> uh, and the Falcons are also being investigated. We, we hinted this, really, for uh, piping in crowd noise. I don't oh. care. Yeah, I don't know. Really it's care. like the infl- deflated balls. I don't give a shit. Yeah, they're, yeah. they're saying that uh, it could cause... The other teams counts to not be heard and huddles and blah blah blah. But well, the Falcons were also like three and five at home this year. Yeah, and then so most didn't teams work too well. yeah. most teams on the road go with the silent count anyways. The, now, the Atlanta's not really the best fan base either. I mm. mean, they probably just made them sound like regular fans. Right. Those... My guess is they're doing this for TV. Yeah. You, you pipe to, it in and it sounds like, like people are. Look actually how cool there. it is to be at an Atlanta, Atlanta Hawks Hawk Falcons game. Yeah. Yeah. Listen to that. See, it's only cool to be at, at a Hawks game. Hawks game now. Yeah. Yeah. All demographics. Uh, Please come to the Hawks. I bet they still don't even care about that team. Yeah. No. No. Oh, it's ridiculous. It's going to sell cheaper than the Bucks did. Yeah. Five hundred million for mm-hmm. the Bucks. Mm-hmm. I bet. I bet Hawks will go for about the same. Yeah. Which is sad. Sad. It is sad. Former Dominique Wilkins team, right there. Yeah, you should buy him. Right. He should. He should. Didn't he try to put t- money together by the Clippers? I don't know. Wasn't he part of Dominique something? Wilkins? I think so. I don't know. They made be that much money though. Who Dominique? He'd be he'd be like probably not a small portion of a yeah. He'd be like the Magic Johnson to the Dodgers. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, the face of the, yeah. the group. Yeah, the, I'd like that. Yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, Spud Webb over there with him. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> yeah. Let's talk about some justice. It's a Last week, the Hernandez trial started. That's it. It's a Just need time to drink. No, it's too bad they don't get down like they did with OJ and everything. You know, I'm like looking for like court like portraits and everything. Yeah, like, gloves Hernandez. not fitting. Yeah, yeah. Well, the portraits they're showing are of Odell or uh, Odell o- Lloyd. What's his first name? Uh, Oscar. No, it's, it starts with no though. 
Odell. Why do I think it's it's, it's, it's Odell Lloyd? Odin. Odin. Odin Lloyd. Odin Lloyd. Odin Lloyd. Odin Lloyd. Odin Lloyd. That's right. They keep showing pictures of him in front of his sports reporter. His mom's in the courtroom. They keep showing his pictures of dead, dying body, and she's oh, like, he's having to like leave the uh, courtroom with crying. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, oh, okay.